What's going on guys? My name is Cal, Joe Break Central, and today I'm going to be showing you how to put a subscribe button inside of a YouTube video. Uh, there's a variety of reasons you'd want to do this. The main one is to encourage people to subscribe to your videos, usually at the end, uh, the last 10 seconds or so. So this is going to be an actual subscribe button. It's going to look something like this, um, and people will be able to click on it and then directly subscribe to your video. Um, so all you have to do is open up your editing program, whichever you use. It could be Final Cut Pro, iMovie, doesn't really matter. All of them have this feature. Um, and then all you have to do is go to uh, Google and search for a subscribe button image. should look something like this. doesn't really matter what it is. Choose one that you like um, and then just click View Image. And you either have to download it or just drag it directly into the editing program. Um, so go ahead and do Save Image As. Go ahead and download it and then just drag it directly into uh, the timeline of the project. You can see now I have a subscribe button inside of the video. Um, now once you're here, you basically just transform it uh, in Final Cut using this little box here. Uh, I believe iMovie, it's this sort of, I'm pretty sure it's the same thing. Um, and then you can make it smaller or larger depending on uh, how big you want it. And then go ahead and drag that to the corner of the video wherever you want it again and then export that video. Um, and then once you've exported that video, we'll go over to YouTube once you upload the video um, and we'll make it clickable so that people can actually subscribe by clicking on the button. Okay, so once you have uh, uploaded the video to your YouTube account, go ahead and find it in the Video Manager tab in the Creator Studio. Once you've found it, go ahead and click on Edit. Um, and this is where we'll actually make the button clickable. So once you've clicked Edit, go to Annotations at the top bar and then click Add Annotation, and then go to Spotlight. Uh, once again, Add an Annotation, Spotlight. It'll bring up this transparent box, and you basically just place the box directly over the Subscribe button. You don't have to worry about the second one. This is just for text, which we won't be using. So once you've placed it over there, go ahead and click on Link, and then on the Video tab, uh, drop down to Subscribe, and then just enter your YouTube username. Uh, if you don't know your YouTube username or if you're trying to find that, I have a separate video for that, which I'll put in the description of this video. So once again, if you don't know your YouTube username or if, if it's not working for some reason because sometimes the names are weird, uh, go to the link in the description for that other video, which will teach you how to get that. Once you've done that, uh, it will work. People can click on the subscribe button and it will actually take them to a page where they will subs or can subscribe uh, to your video. So hope you guys enjoyed that video. Um, if you guys learned something, if you have any questions, feel free to leave those down below. And that, I'll see you guys later.